First of all, the book review is the hot spot, and everybody knows it. Ask Al Roker, I've been here before, ask any of these authors. So I think it's one of those cool things that when you walk in, you feel like you're part you're a part of something bigger. I mean, for me, it was so much fun. I walked in and I saw this crowd of people and I was thinking, who the hell are they here for? Welcome back to Huntington. We're so glad that you're here again, especially since your book just came out yesterday. This is a real honor for us. I'm here because you are probably one of the most inspirational people that I know. You get my day started with your smile, your funny stories, your upbeat attitude. You are just the best. Every day I take four hours of the Today Show to fast forward three hours to get to Hoda and Kathy Lee. Um, I think Hoda's great. She's inspirational. Hoda, I think that you are such a warm, sincere, sensitive woman, intelligent and beautiful, candid and honest. Yes, I love Hoda. I think about her in the daytime, I think about her at night, I obsess with her, and my wife puts up with it. I love her, and I love that you never stop smiling, no matter how many times Kathy Lee shows that hair photo of her. It never gets her go. And after work every day, whether it was Monday fun day, Tuesday booze day, Wednesday wine day, um, we'd sit, have a drink, and watch you. You're fabulous, you're great, you make me happy, and more than that, you make me laugh. So good luck to you, and I hope to enjoy the evening. And it was so fun to know that they came out to see, to see me and to, uh, to get a copy of the book. And I feel really lucky, you know, a lot of these folks, you know, they, they came and they didn't just come with nothing in their hands, they came with bottles of wine. I mean, that's a sad testament to our television program. But they were giving me bottles of wine. I got five bottles of wine, okay? And we need to check into AA quickly. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. I think it's in the line. It's just a guess. Oh! Oh my god! Red Diva Sangria. <laughs> Anyway, this book is, I feel really lucky to have worked on this book with my with a great, great co-author named Jay Lorenzini, and the book again is called Ten Years Later, and it's you take a significant event in someone's life and you fast forward ten years to see what became of them. And I think we all wish that we could read the tea leaves, and I think this book is so inspirational and it'll make you think to yourself, you know what, if this person made it through that, I can make it through this. And I think that's really the bottom line. Hopefully the book will lift you up. We felt like everyone was kind of in a little bit of a funk. You know, especially last year was difficult for so many people. Some big events like Hurricane Sandy and the shooting in Newtown and other things, just people had personal issues. And I think we've all been at the front end of something scary. And you don't know how you'll get through 10 minutes, let alone 10 years. So we thought, wouldn't it be kind of a cool idea to find people who had a life-changing event and to fast forward in their life 10 years to see what became of them. And we were looking for optimistic stories. We wanted, we wanted to lift people up. And we found six incredible, really, really great people.